Hello everyone! In this video, I will show you how to upload multiple files using this web application, store all your uploaded files in Google Drive, and create related records. To demonstrate that, I have built a sample app where you can easily create profiles of different persons. You can enter general details like name, email, and age, and multiple profile pictures. Let me show that to you. Once a file is uploaded, you will see a green check mark. Then you can go ahead, submit the form, and the record will be created. You can view individual profile details by clicking the view icon. This will display all your profile details along with the uploaded pictures in a grid fashion. You can also click to open it in a separate tab. You can also edit the profile, add or delete existing files, and resubmit the changes done. Let me show you where the files are uploaded. The files will be uploaded to the folder inside the parent folder containing the spreadsheet. The folder is automatically created inside the parent folder containing the spreadsheet based on the provided name in the script. This is the spreadsheet where the uploaded records are saved in JSON format. Since this format is not user-friendly, you will need to view the records in the web app itself. Now, let me show you how to set up everything and make this application your own. First, go to the spreadsheet and make a copy from the link given in the description below. After that, open the script editor by clicking on Extensions and then App Script. On top, you can provide the name of the folder where the files will be uploaded. Down below is the schema which is used to configure the app, build the form, table, and detail view. For instance, you can edit the logo of the application. Make sure the logo is shared publicly, copy the ID of that logo, and type it in here. You can also change the sheet name. You can configure things like title, detail view, and the form width. To customize form fields, you need to edit the fields object. To upload files, you just need to set the type attribute to files. You can change other attributes like key, label, and required. After you have finished editing, hit the Save button. Then, you need to deploy the script. To deploy, go to Deploy and click on New Deployment. In the Deployment type, choose Web App. Give it a name in the description box, select Me for the Execute type, and for access, choose only myself if you want to use it privately or select anyone for broader access. Click the Deploy button. After deployment, you will get a URL to access the application. Open the URL to check if everything is working properly. Let me test this quickly.
and it has successfully uploaded files. If you need to edit the schema later, you must redeploy the script. Fortunately, you don't need a new URL every time. Instead, go to Manage Deployment, click the pencil icon, select New Version, and click the Deploy button again. This way, your changes will be reflected in the web app without changing the URL. That's it for this video about multiple file uploads. You can add as many fields as you like, including multiple files for different purposes. For further customization, you can contact me via WhatsApp or email. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.